tea so if I'm good to you for here um, it's press day amazing I know right it's come so soon so much preparation if you haven't already seen the collection as it is you guys need to see it we have our very very own designer here Stephanie Pratt with me big Ooh. round of applause <laughs> How excited are you? Oh my, I didn't sleep last night. Literally, it's just been months and months and months. I'm so excited for everyone to see the collection. Just, oh my god. Yeah, so I'm actually really nervous. You're tearing up. <laughs> oh, I'm just tearing up. Okay, so we've got your dying, dying questions here that we've been all collecting, both from our social media. Now, the first question is, why the name French Kiss? Ah, oh, easy. So, actually, I used to live in Paris. I went to university there. And it was there that I decided that I wanted to become a fashion designer. So um, I was studying comparative literature, lols. And while I was there, I was looking at different fashion schools and I called my parents and I was like, okay, next year I'm moving to Milan to go to Instituto Marangoni. And then obviously my parents, they're very supportive, but you know, a bit selfish. So a couple days later, my mom was like, no, no, there's this great new school in LA called FITM. So, that's where I have my fashion design background. Um, so yeah, it just felt like paying homage to Paris where it all started. Perfect, that sounds so interesting. I mean, your inspiration behind it is obviously your history. Tell us more, what inspired you? Um, also just, you know, Parisians are probably the most fashionable citizens of the world. So a lot of the dresses, you know, I wanted lace, I wanted them to be very chic where you could wear the red carpet, but you don't need to be a celebrity to just look like you're wearing, you know, an expensive gown that, you know, that I envision Natalie Portman wearing. So yeah, inspiration was just to make it look as beautiful as possible, very feminine. And fashion, like it's such a rapid um, industry itself. Why fashion? Why have your own fashion brand? Um, I think, you know, when you're, when you love fashion, it's always your dream. I remember when I was four years old, my mom would come into my room and she'd be like, which shoe? And I'd be like, that one. So it's just always kind of been a part of me. I'm, honestly, this day is just like, I'm so, I'm so blown away that this has happened. Um, and I mean, everyone's already seeing your collection as it is. They want to know what's different. Of course, you've got the sequins, you've got the lace. What is it that's gonna make your clothing line stand up for everyone? Um, they're not too risque. I think um, a lot of the dresses for occasion wear, you know, they're mini and you can only really wear them to certain events. Uh, I wanted to make a range that could go from office to nightclub. Um, you know, some of the gowns you could wear with gladiator sandals on the beach. I wanted to be very versatile, something for everyone. Um, hemlines that are longer, I've got a few mini dresses but just modest to really show, you know, how nice and beautiful and elegant us women are. You've had so much involvement with the collection as it is. Um, as you said, you've got full on coverage with it. What's your favorite part of it? You've gone from designing the clothing line to the marketing. What's your favorite part? Oh, it's so hard because I've loved every single stage of this. Um, I mean, even making mood boards is so much fun. Going through magazines and finding dresses that you want to be inspired by, um, sketching. But I think probably when the samples would come to me because it was just like Christmas, but like a Christmas present that like I specifically asked for. <laughs> so um, I, yeah, getting the samples and trying them on, seeing seeing my dream become tangible. Um, and your every celebrity has its own style. I mean, who would you feel like these dresses would look perfect on that would be a dream for them to wear? Oh gosh, um, you know, Rosie Huntington Whiteley, absolutely. Um, and again, Natalie Portman, I think, you know, she does no wrong. Um, and, and Sofia Vergara, because she's got awesome red carpet style. Ah, great choices. Um, I have a really interesting question from one of your fans. Be ready to get tested. 
Can you have a cocktail dress with full sleeves? Oh my god, duh. That's like one of my favorite looks ever, especially if it's sequins. I'm already planning something for the autumn winter like that. Um, I love full sleeves. Also, I know a lot of women don't like to always have their arms out, mm -hmm. and I was very conscious of that when designing this line. So, yeah, I think, you know, some of the chicest dresses are with long sleeves and then even with a sexy back. Yeah, oh gosh, I love sleeves. And you come from such a broad fashion background. Do you ever remember your first, first fashion show that you ever went to? Um, yeah, it's so funny. I used to go to New York Fashion Week every single series. Um, but I think the best fashion moment I had was last season at the Chanel show front row. Ooh. Okay. I think we've got a bad connection, so I want to apologize for this. Stay with us. Um, if we're going in and out, just pretend like you're hearing me. We want to know your questions. Ask us away. I mean, this is your chance to know about press day, so shoot us. Um, we also have an amazing question. What is your facial regime? I mean, you have immaculate skin. Everyone is wanting to know those picture perfect skin. Tell us. Oh gosh, well, one thing is my amazing makeup artist, Melly Sophia. Um, and the other thing is I really found that beauty comes from within, from a healthy body. So when your insides are healthy, it really shows on your outside. Um, I take a mix of vitamins, honestly. Everything from fish oil to vitamin C, I mean, I could go on forever, be like a doctor. But um, yeah, always wash your face at night and sunscreen. And one more question for you. What is on your list next? Autumn, winter. <laughs> That's literally just going next to the next uh, season. I'm just having so much fun. Godiva has been an amazing partner. They've really let me just have full range from A to Z and yeah, I can't thank them enough. Literally, I'm almost in tears throughout the day. This is such a big deal for me. So thank you so much for asking all your questions and being with me on Facebook Live. I've really put a lot into this. So I hope you guys enjoy it. And make sure um, you Instagram me photos of yourselves in my dresses so I can repost. Right, so I think that is a wrap as it is now. I mean, we are so excited for this evening. Thank you so much for tuning in, everyone. We just want to give you so many kisses over the phone right now. So mwah, have a good day, okay? Oh, Bye, guys. Oh, and remember, hashtag Steph times Woo!